what's going on YouTube? It's Avery Heaney TV here. Today we are heading back to Six Flags New England in Agawam, Massachusetts. Today I'm with Tyler. How are you doing? Hey, what's going on everybody? Happy 2024 season. Here we go. Yes sir. And uh, this time when we're going to be at the park, we're going to be seeing a lot of people today. So we might have a really big crowd with us. This is going to be exciting. Now, I am a little key worried though because from what I heard yesterday, Superman was closed all day due to cold weather, but if I had to predict, according to what you said, Tyler, I, I guess with the recent snowstorm, the Connecticut River tends to flood, and that, that probably flooded the first tunnel, maybe. So that could be potentially why it was closed yesterday, from my perspective, maybe. Right, we'll have to just see we'll just have like We'll that. just have to play it by ear on that, and... Um, but seeing it's going to be warmer, it could be a better chance at opening, but... So, quote me on this, but I did hear though, Wicked Cycle is open with brand new wheels. Holy crap, that's gonna be insane. I can imagine it may haul today, and according to a couple of my friends that went to opening day yesterday, like Aiden, Aiden told me that Wicked Cycle was hauling. So, I believe it. So, without further ado, let's go have a Six Flags day. Yes, we are at the park indeed. Wow, this is unreal, folks. So according to my friend Dimitri, Superman will be closed for the whole day. That's expected, though. I mean, I knew something was up with it, but we're here, and we're going to have a Six Flags day no matter what. I heard Wicked Cyclones open, and as we just drove right by it, I saw people like waiting in the station, so that's a good sign. It means it's open, so that's good. The trolley car's got a new repaint. Oh, really? Yes. New repaint on the Oh, I think they cars. had that last year. I've noticed that repaint, actually. Really? Yeah. All right, everybody. We just made it into the park, and the first attraction is going to be Wicked Cyclone. Now, it's open. I uh, hear it's running two trains. And apparently, people are saying they have new wheels to Wicked Cyclone. So, if that's the case, oh, man. I am wicked excited for this. Here we go, folks. Wicked Cyclone is our first attraction for 2024. Let's do this. All righty, Avery. Initial thoughts. Oh, my God. Everybody is saying they have new wheels on Wicked Cyclone, and that was unbelievable today. Is it faster than 2024? It was insane. Much faster in the rear than... I want to say the front. Like Avery, the is it faster than tw in 2024 than 2023? Um, it's like roughly the same in my eyes right now. No, I was a little staple with the lap bar, but uh, other than that, fantastic ride. All right. Here does it, folks. The 2024 is faster than 2023. All right, guys. So I did a couple rides already. I did one ride on Wicked Cyclone. That was fantastic. I also did one ride on Pandemonium, which automatically... Put Shredder to shame. Oh, for the fans out there, I'm going to retry Flashback. The last time I went on it, it was dreadful. And it's not reliable either. All right, guys, we just got a flashback. And I'm going to be honest, this time it was not as bad as I remember, actually. But, like, it, is it great? No. And it's not F tier anymore. It's now, like, D tier somewhere. Um, maybe not as rough as Demon Demon now. I'm not entirely sure yet. But that was... I think they made a little improvement with Flashback. According to Dimitri, he claims that it was actually pretty good all those years. Well, it's not good, but, you know, it's definitely not as bad as people say. Yeah, definitely. And how was that for you, Aiden? Yeah, he had a bad experience. Like, his reaction in the Cobra roll, he was like, ah! It was so... <laughs> Oh that God, was that was again. a bad one, definitely for sure. Yeah, never again, bro. No. Never again for you. No. no. I'll ride it if it's like a short wait. It's definitely not worth like 20 minutes. I'll say that. Oh yeah, I think I have to. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, all new trains. Look. It's, it's not new trains. It's just repeat. Yeah. I hope Superman is open. I was literally freaking the heck out when I saw its first test run with the riders on it, the employee. Look at that thing go. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is for you. 
It's open. I didn't think this was going to happen at all today. I knew for sure it was going to be closed because I heard there was something up with like the wheel like with a loose bolt or something, but... I don't know how this happened, but Tyler thought this was going to open around 4 o'clock, and sure enough, he was correct. I am speechless. I can't wait. Let's go, Superman. All right, we got some enthusiasts here today. We got Brett, and we got Alex. It's been a while. And what's your name? What? What? Brett. Brett, that's a nice name. And can't you guys believe Superman reopened? We we knew for sure it was going to be closed today, based on based on like every enthusiast has been claiming. But like, wow, I'm just speechless in the fact it just opened up, and so far it's running pretty good, I think. Standby line didn't move for like ten minutes. It was out of pace. Obviously, because it's one train ops today. And initially said close for weather. Yeah. Like what the? They took away that sign, which closed the mail the coffin. Aiden, what's your thoughts now that Superman reopened? I actually freaked out. When uh, I saw we both freaked out when we saw the first test run. False test run. Oh my god. Hey, Brett, you ready for Superman? Yeah. Who's ready for Superman? Yeah. yeah. Woo! So, Brett, how was Superman for you? Um, I might be back in my top 10, I think. I don't know for sure, but that was running really fast. Oh, that was. Wow, that was awesome. Aiden, how was Superman? <gasps> oh, my God. It was amazing, yeah, dude. So good. Oh that thread never gets old. Tyler and I had a blast on it. That was unbelievable. It that first Camelback, folks, I was yanked out of my seat. It was so violent, too. I know the restraints aren't the greatest. They were practically like El Toro's restraints, but just heavier. But, like... But I still don't like mind them. Like they don't bother me as much, and I just like still get flung out of my seat. Strong positive G's. It's still in my top five. All right, so the Gotham City area is a little dead now. So I don't know how long Batman's wait's going to be. God forbid. I hope it's not one train. Do you know if it's two trains, Dimitri? I believe it's two trains. All right, so we just got off Batman. There was pretty much no waits, but dispatches were very slow on Batman today. How was Batman for you, Dimitri? It was all right. Yeah. A little horseless, honestly. Just not normal, but whatever. Gotcha. And Tyler, how was it? Very good. Nice and smooth. Nice. So it's pretty much 6.30 now, and Superman's wait for a one train today now is a lot better than it was before. The first time I had to wait for Superman was probably like a good 35 to 40 minutes. But um, now that the line is short, let's get on Superman. We got the one and only Canopy Coaster with us today. And uh, how was your ride on Superman earlier? Good, glad it finally opened and uh, getting at least me another ride or two before the park closes. Nice. And... Um, how do you think Wicked was today? Oh, it's running great. It always runs good in the cold. <laughs> it never gets old. When I went on the last day, it, it was like 40 degrees yeah. and it was flying. Enjoy your ride, dude. Enjoy your ride. Yeah. Let's go. Uh -huh. Woo! Yeah. had them there. We had to put your cup on this thing and then scan your code before you can go so But it's not here. Yeah. This part doesn't have that much. Right. Welcome back. Welcome back, Ryder. How's your ride? Woo! How's the ride? Really good. Nice. Meet you at the exit, Brett. Meet you at the exit. All right, guys. Our last ride of the day was Superman the Ride. Oh, my God. That second ride I just had on it. Unbelievable. It was even hauling on the second part. The first ride was, like, a tad slow, but I can see why because it was warming up. But then, towards the end of the ride, what really caught me off guard was the trims were on for the last Bunny Hills. But I got a little pop of ejector before even landing on it. Unbelievable, guys. Now the park is just about closed. No mist, of course, on Superman today. That's obvious. Dimitri, yeah, how was your up? ride? It's great. 
Loved it. That was insane. Front row was better. Canopy, how was your ride? Great. That was insane. And Brett, what did you like about Superman this time? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he knows. So it was good, but right before, so Canopy and I was, were going to go in for another ride, but then they cut the line off in the station. Like we were in the queue line, but then when we got to the station, the opposite were closed. Go, go around. So oh. Like, oh. Rip. Yeah. And Tyler, that ride was crazy. That was awesome. Well, Six Flags New England has pretty much come to an end for today. And I gotta say, for opening weekend, that was a blast. Didn't expect Superman to open later on in the day. That was a saving grace. I told you. Four o'clock was gonna open. I don't know why his predictions was correct. <laughs> now that if you notice something, Superman's trains is actually repainted. Now in the advertisement, it's still the original. So I, mean to, I was like dodging you. <laughs> Sorry. No, you're good. Brett? How was your day overall at the Good. park? Um, kind of crowded. Like we, we had 40 minutes for Superman the first ride because they were only loading the standby line every other. And time. like every other was flash pass. Like yeah. they couldn't decide which or which. Like we're not poor advertisers. <laughs> this is six bucks New England. Like what is what are we doing? But it was a good day. Yeah, it definitely was. Um, now the park is closed for the day, and um, I gotta say, for the amount of rides we did, for the amount of time we were there, pretty good. Well, everybody, what a Six Flags day Tyler and I had today. Not only that, we got to meet up with many enthusiasts today, including Canopy Coaster. That was a treat. We just entered New York now, and I'll be back home probably with the next 40-ish minutes or so. But um, this was a blast. Tyler, what was your favorite part of the day? Gotta say when Superman opened. Oh, yeah, absolutely. That's That was definitely the biggest highlight for me because I've never been, like, freaking out at a park when like when I saw a test running like I I knew for sure it was gonna be closed today but I got somehow lucky this was a treat and I did one ride of Wicked Cyclone I even got to do Pandemonium flashback I got a decent amount on for opening weekend it was cool seeing Brett again Canopy Coaster Alex you name it well folks I'm gonna end it right here thanks for watching please comment and subscribe below and as always peace out and have a Six Flags day